Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I just wanted to pop in a quick in in introduction in here um, to tell you guys about these cookies. Crunchy on the outside, soft on the inside. They're vegan, they're gluten-free, refined sugar-free, and they're really delicious. I wanted to ask you guys a really important question. I wanted to ask you guys to pop in your recommendations down below in the comment section uh, about what videos you prefer to see on my channel. As you can see, lately I've been trying different different types of content. Um, I also wanted to introduce myself to all my new subscribers because my channel has grown so quickly and it's so exciting. So I wanted to thank you for subscribing. And if you haven't subscribed yet or are watching this video, be sure to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell thingy so I um so you get a notification. Yeah. Oh, the sun. Woo. Yeah. That's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you next week. Mwah. Hey guys, here I am again. I just wanted to do a quick voiceover to tell you guys what you're seeing. This is a little bit of baking soda, some salt, ground cinnamon, my flex seed eggs, <laughs> and some coconut oil, which still needs to be melted. This is some maple syrup, Mixed nuts, just some pecan nuts, walnuts, and cashews. And these are my oats, which I'm about to turn into flour and a fresh okay? yummy pear. Yeah, I'm fine. Start off by actually preheating your oven first and turning the oats into flour just by placing them in your blender and blend. <laughs> I just need some fresh air and an old friend I'm so glad that we started talking again You turn up the radio, I love this song Remember when we used to stay up all night long How's it been going, no how's it mom? As you can see, I transferred the oat flour uh, to a mixing bowl and I'm just continuing to add the other dry ingredients which is the salt, the baking soda and the cinnamon. Just make sure dry ingredients first. On another one of our famous midnight drives. Do you need to rant or just stay silent? Either or, you know I'm complying. Take a left up ahead, we're going towards the horizon. Don't stop going till we see the sun rising. You know this is who we are, this is what we do. Driving in circles till we find something new. The only person I enjoy is sitting in the car. With now continue to add your wet ingredients, uh, which is the maple syrup. We can drive around to the sky and the melted coconut oil. My bowl is a little bit dirty because I had a little, I, uh, uh, I had a few flax seeds in there. No feeling the ocean breeze. If it's fine by you, I'll be And my flex eggs. By the way, guys, I wrote the recipe um, on my blog and I linked my blog um, down below. This is what it should look like after you mixed it. Uh, now continue to add your diced pear. In my opinion, I had a little bit too much pear. Um, so you can just add like half a pear or um, I don't know, whatever you prefer. Be sure to cut them really small though. Here you can see me just making little balls by rolling them between my hands. Be sure to wash your hands beforehand, of course. And I'm just placing that on my lined baking tray. And continue to that. But it gets harder with like every cookie that you make um, because this dough is really sticky. 
So um, I didn't think of this at the time, but my tip to you is to wash your hands or wet your hands in between every cookie um, so the dough doesn't stick too much to your fingers because, oh man, it was messy. You'll see in a few seconds. <laughs> this is getting pretty messy already <laughs> I'm really struggling um, I don't know why I didn't like wash my hands in between I just I don't know this is the result really disgusting I know but yeah it was more dough for me to eat as you can see me doing there radio I love this song remember when we used to stay up all night long how's it been going oh how's it mom the roads are so empty this is so damn calm if we stick on the highway we can drive all night as you can see I'm placing the nuts uh, on top of the cookies here you can add them in your mixture if you want to uh, but I decided to add them on top just to give that extra crunch to the outside of the cookies The dough is so sticky that n the nuts just, you know, stick on there. They won't fall off. And um, by this time, your oven should be pretty preheated. And this is what your cookies should lo look like before you pop them in your oven. I'll take the passenger seat. We can drive around to the sky and see me. There's an empty bowl. And this is what they look like after they're done. I am really happy with this recipe. Um, they're really delicious. I really hope you'll enjoy these cookies if you decide to make them. Here I am again, guys. <laughs> if you made it all the way to the end of this video, thank you. You're the bomb. You the bomb. Um, and I hope to see you next week. And I have a little secret. In three days, my giveaway will be ending and I will be giving away the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette. And I will see you soon. Mwah!